hi there welcome back to my youtube channel today's video we're going to learn how to make a beautiful uh, color dress i have my fabric on the table scissors roller pin uh tape and chalk i have my fabric folded into two and the length of my dress is 60 inches plus my folding allowance so i'll mark out three inches for my neck uh wideness then also i will take my cross shoulder that is from the middle of my shoulder down to the length of my sleeve and i have 21 here so i'll mark out 21 so from that 21 i'll take my shoulder slant so i mark out 1.5 for my shoulder slant and i'll be connecting from my three inches down to the one and half i marked out from my shoulder slant i'm going to mark out my sleeve circumference and for the sake of this video the sleeve circumference I'm making use of is 10 and half inches. 10 and half inches. As you can see. Then also, I'm going to take my vertical measurement. That means my bust, my hip, I mean my waistline, my hip line, and my full length. So I'll mark out my hip, my bust line here, which is 10 and half. Also, my half length, which is uh, 17 and half. Then my hip line, which is 25 inches. And my full length, my full length is 60 inches. I will roll this out, my hip line, my half length, and my bust line. So from there, I'm going to take my circumference, my body circumference. So my bust line, I will take my bust circumference. 38 divided by 4 will give us 9.5 so I'm going to mark us 9.5 on my bust line plus 3 inches this will serve as my ease and my sewing allowance remember a gun is a free one so my waistline my half length I will take my waist circumference 34 divided by 4 will give us 8.5 plus 3 inches ease and sewing allowance. Then on my hip line, I will take my hip circumference 40 divided by 4 will give us 10. So I'll mark out 10 plus 3 inches ease and sewing allowance. I will go ahead and mark out 13 inches down to my floor length, my full length. As you can see. Then I'm going to use my ruler to connect all the lines together. So I'm connecting the line from the full length to my hip length to my waist and down to my bust line. So from my bust line, I will mark one and a half inches downward. 
and this will serve as my ham whole cuff. So from here, her sleeve is ready. So for the neckline, I'll mark out several inches. This will serve as my neck depth. Remember the wideness of our neck is 3 inches, so 3 by 7. Then for the back parts, I will mark out 1.5. So I will be connecting this line with my ham hole cuff. So you can either have it as a straight v-neck or a slightly curved v-neck. Just as you can see in this video. So for my front part, I'll mark one one quarter inches inward. And this will be connected back to my neckline. So I'm going to go ahead and cut my fabric. And I'll be cutting the back part first. So the front part of my folded fabric, now I'm going to cut out the neckline. And from that one one quarter inches I indicated, I'm going to notch this part. As this will help my collar to relax very well. As we can see, I'm notching this part. So I will go ahead and make some changes on my sleeve part. I extended the sleeve circumference by 13 inches instead of the 10 inches I previously used. So I want to have more volume on my sleeve. And also I reduce the length by one and a half inches. So I have a perfect sleeve now. So for my color and my font design, I'll be making use of this beautiful African print. I have joined my fabric together, so I'll measure from the notch part on the right, round to the neckline, to the notch part on the left. And so I have 21.5 inches. So I'll go ahead and measure my color. And uh, for the length, I'll mark out 22 inches. And for the wideness, I'll mark out 4 inches. So on fold, it will be 2 inches. So I will go ahead and iron an interface on my collar and the front design. Also for the front design, I have 16 inches by length and 4 inches for the wideness. So I've attached my color and my front design. And here we go. I have my beautiful dress ready to be rock. Friends, if you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, kindly do. And click on the notification bell to get notified when I upload new videos. Join me next time for another wonderful video. Remember, all on premium fashion love you. Bye.